everyone? Welcome to another episode of JL Jupiter TV. And in this episode, we're going to try out this Thai spot here at the Reading Terminal Market because everyone's been recommend because everyone's been recommend I can't even say it because everyone's been recommending them. There you go. I can do it because everyone's been recommending them, and they said to get the salmon and shrimp platter, which is like this blackened salmon with this shrimp, and they put like this curry sauce on top, and it's nonstop, guys. They are packing this pretty much an assembly line. People are lining up for this still here at the Reading Terminal Market to get this platter right here to get I cannot speak today to get this platter here specifically so stay tuned for the video and uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel Boom. <laughs> I got PPA right here. I got PPA. What up, PPA? <laughs> Sometimes you got to throw a smile at them, let them know you here. But anyways, I got the salmon. Excuse me, what's your favorite place to eat here? Like this place? Mm -hmm. I don't really, what's your video? It's JL Jupiter. I'm gonna follow, is it on YouTube? It's on YouTube, Facebook, everywhere. JL Jupiter. You wanna be in my vlog, say what's up? Of course. Oh, look at this. Look, we got, we got a friendly PPA <laughs> patrol person here. Hold on. Let me, let me show y'all. What's your name? I can't give that oh, You can't give the name? Okay. Undercover, y'all. She undercover. Undercover PPA. Um, JL Jupiter TV. You got I me? I hope you like the food. Uh, it better be good, I too. I there's a place over on, um, on Ray Street. Right on. The, there's two restaurants next to each other on the corner of 10th and Race. Are you talking about David's and um, Ken's? Yes. Have you tried their? Food? Oh yeah, this legendary of place. Did. Legendary of place. You did. Of course, of course. <laughs> you have a great day. You too. When I drop Herschel's, everyone's like, "Yo, you got to go try these spots right here." So that's what I'm here to do. And uh, yo, it's crazy and it's kind of sad too. But Reading Terminal actually has a GoFundMe um, to to stay open. You know what I mean? Like this establishment is just, is really historical, and it's really sad to know that they they are struggling. Um, during these times as uh, as like a, a lot of uh, businesses during this time too so I'm gonna do my part to help out and um, right now it's a Wednesday uh, Wednesday afternoon not crowded at all still has a good crowd but you guys need to come over here and try but I went to the let's do the um the, the little Thai corner spot whatever yo props to them people are lining up for this Thai food for their salmon uh, for their salmon dish platter, right? When I tell you it was non-stop of them making this platter, this salmon and shrimp platter, everyone I asked that was in line, I'm like, so what are you getting? Like, oh, the salmon platter, the salmon platter. Some people actually just popped up and they recognized them and they said, you want the usual salmon? They said yes. So, yo, the salmon platter looks delicious. They put like this curry sauce on top and the sweet sweet Thai chili sauce as well. All right, so let's get into it. Um, this is a really like saucy type dish. It's a lot of sauce at the bottom. It got like the boiled broccoli or steamed broccoli. But people there are really nice. Let's try this baby out. Let's try this baby out. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> now I see what you mean. Now I see what you mean. You know what sends this right over the top? So this is like a curry blackened salmon dish. This is a really, really fulfilling dish. Mm. You know what the killer? You know what the killer of this dish is? Is that curry. You got to get that curry sauce on top. Because that curry is really sweet. Very reminiscent to what my culture does too. But I actually never had it like this before, ever. This right here is a fantastic, fantastic dish. 
I could eat this every day. Because that curry puts it right over the top. Mm. You gotta get the salmon and the shrimp. Yo. Mm. Goodness. Yo, I've never had salmon. I got family that's Thai. They actually never made this for me. This is a fantastic dish. This is a, I'm gonna say game changer on this one because the salmon still has that nice salmon characteristic flavor if you know what I'm talking about, but it's really thin. What really takes the cake here, what really puts this dish over the top is that curry, like soup that you put in there. And quite honestly, you can get that curry on top of rice and be satisfied with it. But the fact that you get a nice slab of salmon and some shrimp on here, fantastic. And make sure that you add like that, that sweet Thai chili sauce as well too. Yo, this is an insane dish here at the Reading Terminal Market. A great Southeast Asian dish. Please don't hit my car. Please don't hit my car. Okay. Yo, everyone needs to try this one. And the fact that this is just salmon, great for anyone that's pescatarian, vegetarian, you guys would thoroughly enjoy this. I can see why the people were lining up for this because there's nothing dry about this one. Yo, you can just get some like French bread, dip it in there. Boom, it's a ball game. I'm not even supposed to eat all this right now because I have more food in the car, but. Mm. Salute to you guys. You guys put me on game. People don't know this. People be like, yo, how do you, how do you find out about all these places? It's because of y'all, man. You guys really, you know, giving me the real MVP spots. And I definitely vet them out to make sure they're official. Everyone was talking great about this place. This is definitely a highly recommended place from me to you guys if you're looking for a Southeast Asian rice dish that's totally worth it. I don't even I don't even know how much I paid for it because I just I think maybe like eleven bucks or something like that. This was insane. That's a very addicting dish. You guys in Reading Terminal Market, come try this place out too. You guys will be satisfied, all right? I'm gonna save the rest for the wife. She's gonna love this dish. So we got the uh, spring rolls next. Spring rolls with the sweet fish sauce. Let's see if there's any crunch here. But let's try this out. Still nice and hot, spring rolls. It's quality too, I mean, it's quality too, so. Spring rolls, it's just a solid spring roll, but that salmon, shrimp, curry platter was to die for. If you guys wanna come here and try it, I'm telling you that, that was amazing. And I was looking for like a Southeast Asian place too to try. That satisfied my craving. So kudos, I don't even know your name, Little Thai Market or Corner or whatever, but kudos to you guys, you knocked it out the park. That was fantastic, y'all. I appreciate you guys joining me. Reading Terminal, I got you. I'm gonna try to do my best to, uh, you know, make people aware that you guys need help. And everyone needs help during these times. So let's do it, y'all. Game changers, appreciate y'all. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. That was delicious. Props to all the recommendations. I can say that word now. I'll see you guys on the next episode, all right? Peace.